Hi guys, welcome back to another Yonder Mountain Review. Um, the last two videos um, I featured uh, this fantastic bit of kit, which is the All Powers S300 portable power station. And I've had a whole stack of questions about it, not only via the video, but also mostly really via Instagram. Um, so people are wanting to know a little bit more about it. So um, today I'm going to do a review video. I'm going to um, give you a good look around the unit itself so you can have a close up. I'll go through what you get with it and I'll go through the specs and also the kind of usability of it as well. Um, All Powers kindly sent me this out with also the, um, there's a foldable um, solar panel as well. That's the SP012 100 watt solar panel. Um, so I'll go through a little bit of information about that as well because that's a really nifty bit of kit um, and it is compatible with all kinds of different solar panels from all powers so we've got quite a bit to get through um, today and I'll give you as much information as possible let's face it ladies and gentlemen Christmas is just around the corner and this is very affordable Well, first of all, let's see what you get when you unpackage this thing. And incidentally, it comes very, very well packaged. That's the box that you get. Um, and quite literally, you get the unit and you get a nice branded all powers bag with the charger cable. That's what you get with it. And of course, the user manual itself. I'll go through separately what you get with the SP012 uh, solar panel. I'll do that a little bit later on the video. Let's concentrate on this unit because I think that's really what people are interested in most of all. So what I'm going to do guys, um, I'll give you a quick run around. I'm going to run through some of the specs first of all so that you've got a better idea of what this thing's capable of. It's small, but does that mean it's weak or is it powerful? Right, let's have a look at some of the specs of this little thing here. Um, first things first, uh, it's a 300 watt uh, power unit so it will actually power any appliance that runs up to 300 watts so it's actually very very versatile you'll have probably seen in my previous videos i was powering uh, a lamp i was charging all kinds of things it's incredibly versatile and it does come with a surge protector up to 500 watts as well uh, the actual watt hour capacity is 288 um you can charge six different devices simultaneously with this unit it's absolutely uh, unbelievable and it is fast charging as well now these are some of the things if you're wanting to buy yourself a little portable power unit like this for camping for car camping you know to keep in your home to take away on camping trips holidays to use in outhouses or summer houses things like that you want it to be fast charging you want it to be durable and you want it to be very very versatile this ticks all the boxes for sure so six simultaneous um charging ports for different appliances really really good um you get your wireless charging on this as well now if you're anything like me i'm forever losing um charging cables so if you've got your mobile phone and you're out and about and you've lost it you can just place your phone on top as long as your phone's compatible for the wireless as well what i particularly like as well and emergency situations or if you're just out and about and your head torches run out or you know whatever it's got a, a really powerful led lamp i'll show you all that in just a moment as well it's very lightweight and it's very small as you can see 3.4 kilograms uh, it is dimensions wise um it is 206 millimeters uh long that's the length if you like by 165 millimeters high by 110 wide so you can see it is very very small and compact but just because it's small and compact doesn't mean it doesn't deliver a punch it really does that's the basic specs of it guys i will put a link in the description so if you're wanting to look into a little bit more of the technical detail of it you can do so but let's get a close-up and I'll give you a 360. We'll have a little bit of a look around this unit so you can get a better idea of what we're dealing with. This thing is incredibly affordable. I'll come on to the price, but this is not breaking the bank. And I've got a discount code as well. Let's have a look. So first things first, as you can see, you've got your nice handle on there as well. It is, like I say, very, very light. It is not a heavy unit at all. 
You've got your three buttons at the side there. The first one, of course, is your on button, and you can see immediately the display panel comes on. Uh, the display panel, as with all the all power stuff, is fantastic. On the right, it tells you what your uh, wattage output and input is. It's got your, um, your battery monitor on there as well, and it'll also tell you how many active hours of usage that you've got as well. To activate the AC, which of course is the three pin plug on the top, quite simply, push the AC button and you can see that the fan will start up and that activates your three pin plug. It is actually whisper quiet as well, as you can probably hear or not hear. And it's just on and off for that. For the DC, again, just that one button there, and then that activates the usage of your two uh, fast charging USB USB 18 watt ports there, and there's a USB C there as well. You'll notice on the top you've got your wireless your wireless charging port, which is absolutely essential. I would have said. As you turn it around. On the side you can see it's got plenty of vents there for airflow and that's your mains charging port there. To turn it around to the back you can see you've got your LED light so if I can just show you that. One push gives you standard brightness then it goes to super bright and then what I really like about it is you also get your strobe as well and then off. Moving around to the other side again vented you've got your universal XT60 that's the yellow port there that is to connect your solar panels uh, which is uh, ideal and of course your DC you've got your 12 volt which is your what used to be known as the cigarette charger if you like uh, but car charger and what have you. So all in all that's your unit so that'll give you a real good idea about the uh, S300 power unit itself. Um, I've used it on quite a few camps now um, and I've never actually been able to fully use the battery um, in fairness and that's been charging drones, charging torches, running power, t power lamps, you know, you name it. I've been using that a lot on camps uh, and I've never really, I think I've got it down to about 47% on an overnighter heavily used so it is actually very very good indeed um, i just want to show you this is the um the the foldable uh one one of the many different solar panels this is a foldable 100 watt three in one solar panel i'll show you how this oh, this kind of opens out i'll show you in just a second exactly how that works um but this is a three in one so you actually get two usb ports with this it's a hundred watt solar panel um, it's completely waterproof and it is UV proof as well. So even in hot weather, cold weather, and if it's raining, it's going to be absolutely fine. Um, and it's a 100 watt panel itself. You get two USB charging ports on it. So you can actually connect the USB cable. It comes with loads of gear. Uh, you can connect your USB cable directly from the solar panel into your smartphone, for example. Um, it's got a DC uh, port on there for plugging into laptops and charging up uh, laptops directly from the solar panel. And it's also got a 12 volt car battery one as well. Really, really good. Again, lightweight. It's only 4.73 pounds. It's, um, it's not a heavy bit of kit. And you can see it's very, very small and compact as well. This is the SP012. Again, link in the description. You don't necessarily have to have these as a combination. In actual fact, I would probably go to say that the SP027, which is another all powers solar panel, in my opinion, I would say is better. It's a better, it's a better quality and it's a better charging unit. Um, it is bigger, it's more robust, it's easier to situate, and you get a better solar charging experience with the SP027 than you possibly do with this one, in my opinion. And the SP027 is cheaper as well. Now, you know my channel, ladies and gentlemen, it's all about budget, trying to keep the costs down. So although I'm showing you this, a lot of people will like the versatility of a foldable solar panel, but in fairness, I think the 02, 0, 002 
7 is a better solar panel. Right guys, hopefully that's given you all of the information, a good look around the unit, the specs. Remember, there's a link in the video description as well for if you want to have a little bit more technical information on them. Also, running through the SP012, and I've mentioned the SP027 100 watt solar panel as well. Um, very, very versatile. Any questions, do let us know in the comments. Um, let's just see how, how much you need to spend to get your hands on one of these things. So the unit itself currently at the time of recording on the All Powers website is £146. But I've got a discount code. If you, uh, if you click on the link in the description and then you use the discount code Yonder Mountain Adventures, all one word, put that into the cart, you'll get a 10% discount. So in actual fact, that will mean this on its own is £131 um, and it's a fantastic bit of kit. So if you are interested, click on my link, use my discount code, save the money. It's better off in your pocket than anybody else's. £131 for the unit. Um, now, if you're wanting it with the SP012, the foldable solar panel, uh, which you've seen there, the actual solar panel itself is £169, so as a combo, it's £318 for these two. Um, with the discount, that makes it £286. So again, you're getting a good discount on that as well. But I think, personally, my recommendation would be, if you want to either get it on its own, um, or get it with the SP027 100 watt solar panel that combination would have meant it's 239 pound and with the discount 215 pound 215 so for just over 200 quid you can get yourself this unit and a 100 watt solar panel um, and you can see that is a at a more cost effective option than buying maybe the foldable one but that would appeal to a lot of people as well so you can see I'm not trying to flog this, but I know we're coming up to Christmas. I've had a load of questions. And if this helps anybody have portable power on the move when they're going camp and when they're going car camp, and I know there's a lot of people interested and you're not having to break the bank, you can spend 40 quid on one of the little, you know, portable power banks, which are crap, you know, and don't last. And you'll get a couple of charges on your phone. They're a waste of time. I've had loads of them. This is absolutely mint. Well, there we go, guys. I hope that's helped. I hope you found it interesting. I hope it's answered all your questions that you've got. It gives you a few different options. It's not expensive anyway, but use my discount code, Yonder Mountain Adventures. Bag that extra discount. Uh, availability is great. All Powers is a great company. I've been dealing with them for quite some time now. I've used a whole stack of their equipment um, and um, the build quality is great. I can 100% vouch for it. Just because a company sent us some good gear doesn't mean I'm gonna say it's good if it's not. If it's crap, I'm gonna tell you it's crap. Um, I've used this uh, and that's why I've held off doing the review. I wanted to test it out properly first so I could give you my honest opinion about it in use on a camp. It's absolutely fantastic, great. Guys, um, any questions, leave them in the comments. Do hit us up on Instagram uh, as well, Yonder Mountain Adventures. I know a lot of people reach out on, on Instagram, sometimes even more than the YouTube videos themselves. So do feel free. I'm happy to answer any questions that I can. The link is in the video description. It'll answer more questions, maybe technical-wise for that as well. Bag yourself a bargain, guys. Bag yourself a bargain. So I think that just about wraps it up for this review video. You'll see it on a lot more adventures coming up because I'm going to be using this a lot because it is so versatile instead of lumping the big, massive, heavy ones, which are much more powerful, but of course are more bulky. This is uh, this is uh, much easier to take around with you, uh, for sure. So you will see it in more adventures. As always, guys, if you like the video, do give it a thumbs up. It helps with the YouTube algorithm, but most of all, it lets me know that you're enjoying the video, and I'll keep doing these types of videos and product reviews for you if you're finding them useful. Hit the subscribe button if you haven't already done so. And of course, hit the notification bell. That way, every time I upload a new adventure video or review video or the Yonder Mountain podcast, 
you will get a notification on your phone. Guys, also, if you haven't already done so, check out the link in the video description and come and join the Yonder Mountain Facebook community page as well. We've got uh, nearly 200 like-minded legends over there, and it's nothing but inspiration and, you know, people sharing excellent experiences of camping and all of this type of things. It is fantastic. Come and say hello. Guys, on that note, I'm going to love you and leave you, and I look forward to seeing you on next week's Yonder Mountain Adventure. Fantastic. <laughs>